North of New York City by a few hours, I came to a place called Fire Island, and I am in a house called Reflections. Now we're here to shoot a show for social media. Have you ever seen the movie Project X? A really huge party in a huge ginormous house. That is what Reflections the house is known for. If you have seen how gigantic this house is, then you understand that there's gonna be massive crowds here. We are trying to promote the party atmosphere and a show branding in that sorts. Yeah, this is ginormous. Yeah, this is a big house. Hey! Hi! Oh, you made it! I think so. Okay. I'm Harper, nice, nice to meet you. Meet you. you guys are, so, are kind freezing. of close in age. Oh, cool. How old are you? I'm 21. 24, I think. Yeah. We are on set at this house to promote a party that we are going to be hosting tonight. Daniel Nardicio is actually the entire, the person that put this entire thing together and he is the person behind the structure as far as what we are supposed to make here. Whole team involved, not just myself, I am on set as a filmmaker and cinematographer, DP. Also an editor, so last night we were having meetings about what we are supposed to be getting as for the shots that can tell a great story for this kind of party. During the cusp of the ending of COVID, yes, but a lot of us are already vaccinated and this is a very controlled place. Fire Island is on the top end of Long Island, New York. You get here on a ferry and once you get here it's just immediate land and houses. It's right on the water. It's really beautiful, especially this house. If you could think of a Kardashian style house. Now to put this in perspective of how crazy it is for me, I am not from a place like this. What a chef. I know right, I love to cook. I love to cook. All I'm surrounded by right now is water and deep ocean. The thing that I'm used to is just dirt everywhere. Desert. <laughs> I moved to New York City a month ago, and this insanity of getting opportunities to work with other people, other businesses, and other brands creatively to help build those up is just a whirlwind of unexpectedness that I am trying to experience as I'm experiencing it. The only thing is, is that I, I feel like there might be a problem here, and maybe not, but there is a lot of work to be done, and a short amount of time to do it. So the rigors of trying to get all of this work done in just a few hours tonight is going to be interesting. We're basically trying to make an episode series that entails the atmosphere of Project X, the movie, but it has to be done by a smaller crew than Project X was, and that's not always completely possible, especially with things like right now in the world. Either we are able to make this happen and the two of us who is the other person with the camera and I'm the editor with the camera, well, <laughs> we have to try and get this done and if not then it just all goes to hell. If you come to New York City, expect to be interacting with other people that might be in your career field and then you can work with them and, well, build each other up relationship-wise and careers. It's the work that matters and the work that I think, well, I would encourage all of us to tune into. Medium roast, cinnamon, and honey. Not bad. That was necessary. Okay, time to show you the pool and the bigger pool behind the pool. You'll see what I mean. back to Manhattan. I pretty much left off right before the start of the production for this show that we're doing there. Mostly because I can't share like 95% of what we were shooting. We shot for a total of maybe 13 hours as well. It was non-stop throughout. I was the main camera using a gimbal and this setup as well as just working with the director and his vision for what we wanted this to look like. In its entirety, along with the acts that were hired, there were models, there were actors, all kinds of stuff to 
promote this brand that we're trying to build for this event of sequences. We're trying to tell this exotic, chaotic, fun story about a party in a huge house, and it'll go back and forth throughout that and another location here in Manhattan that you will be seeing here shortly in the next few months as it kind of goes through with production. Like I said earlier in this movie, think about Project X just on steroids, and that's pretty much what we're doing here. You know, I never would have thought that all of these news outlets, NBC, Today Show, they're all like in the same place. Am I the only one who thinks that's kind of weird since they have their own studios in separate places of this city? Basically, all that needs to be done now is myself finishing the edit because this movie is going to go into a campaign and this campaign is going to last throughout the entire summer. But I couldn't just go on set and not bring you guys along with me to see what's happening, right? 